is going on everybody welcome back to another episode of stone cold cards rips and reviews just the camera here today we have a bit of a random shop rip red rose sports cards happen to have some 2022 panini contenders basketball blasters and some 2021 fat pack we're gonna mix it up and see what hits we can get today so we're gonna start it off with panini contenders basketball you get one autograph or mem in these boxes Retail exclusive rookie season ticket stickers and ultra rare rookie season ticket stub stickers. Here are the odds if you would like to take a look, obviously. Looking for anything that we can find here. But you know what it is. It is no bull, all bulls. We are going to dig into it. Shout out Red Rose Sports Cars for always keeping it stocked with great product and hooking us up to make sure that we can deliver good content to our viewers. So we have NBA playoffs kicking off. It looks like we may have a, oh, maybe not. We may have an auto. None of those really look super. Like, let's take another look here. Yeah, they look, all right, we might actually have an auto box. Ah, that kind of feels like a mem, so we're going to save that guy for the last. But obviously, we're looking for any of the uh, top rookies here, like Suggs, Cunningham. We'd love to pull a Cunningham. Scotty Barnes is solid. But just, uh, you know. Season ticket and contenders, rookies, rookie autos, they're usually pretty sought after. So we're going to start off with Okoro. That's our base look here. Schroeder, Miles Turner, Buddy Hild. We got the blue season ticket, Steven Adams, Andrew Wiggins, Kevin Love. And we got a game night ticket, Bradley Beal. That's a cool looking card. I do like the contenders cards, just the way they look. I think they're good looking cards and... When you do get a solid rookie out of them, it's usually one that'll hold its value pretty well. So we got Christian Wood, Okiki, Griffin, Russ. Don't know where Russ is going to be next year. That could be interesting. I'd love to see if Mr. Beal could end up in Philadelphia like everybody keeps saying. Darius Garland. We got Duncan Robinson. We got a red game ticket. Alexander. That's a cool card. I like the red foil. And then we got a 2021 rookie draft class, Trey Mann, which I think is in every blaster. I've seen it in every blaster break that I have seen. You're only getting five packs per box on this, eight cards per pack. So it's not a ton of packs, but when you hit, I'd say you hit pretty well for the most part. Capella, Kuzma, Porzingis, not going to try. Jayba, I wish he would have stayed in Philly, to be honest. I really do. Van Fleet. And Isaiah Jackson, 2021 draft class. All right. So we have two more packs, and I believe we did get a mem box. That last pack, now that I look at it, does seem to be a bit thicker. So it might be one of the rookie swatches is what I am anticipating. We'll see what that 2021 pack has for us then. So we got Brogdon, Michael Porter Jr., LaMelo, year two. I'm going to hold on to that just because it's a year two. Harden, welcome the beard to the Philly City. Let's go. Get some water ice. I'm a Sixers fan. I'm allowed to make fun of us. <laughs> we got CJ McCollum and, okay, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Game night ticket. Cool card. I like those with the score. The breakdown's pretty sick. All right, so we got Bradley Beal and we got Giannis. And let's see what we got in our last pack here. This is definitely a mem now that I am getting to the ripping part. We're going to do a quick peek. Look at that. There's the mem. <laughs> All right. So we got Jalen Brown, Mora Powell, Baisley, Barrett, Lowry, Trey Murphy on the rookie ticket swatches. All right. Not numbered. Obviously not the hits you want, but we'll take it for a contender's box. And then we got Dominique Wilkins International Ticket. That's pretty cool. Not numbered, but a cool insert for sure. All right, so obviously contenders as far as the blaster boxes on our scale of 1 to 10 for value versus yield, we are going to give this a 4.4 4 out of 10. I feel like for the price point on these, uh, just, I don't know, I feel like 98% of them do have swatches in them over autos i mean you can always go hobby but for retail uh for price point if you're collecting i'm gonna give this a 4.4 .4 out of 10 and again we are grading a little harder so let's dig into this 2021 fat pack 
and see if this can salvage the break of 2022. All right, so we're gonna start off with John Collins. Very similar design. I do like 2021's a little better though, I'm gonna say. They remind me more of the football, I think. And that's probably why. Rosier. Dame time. Oh no, that's McCollum, my bad. There he is, Dame time. Spoken into existence. De'Aaron Fox. Andre Drummond. Butts. Bledsoe. Colin Sexton. I hope I didn't miss anything here. Aaron Gordon. Steven Adams. Michael Porter Jr. Okay, we got a green game ticket. Mello. Mello on the Nuggets. Like, I remember him being drafted, man. That's going to age me a little bit. But the dude is a baller. Period. Giannis Ante Giannis Antetokounmpo game night insert. That's a good looking card. I like that. Not numbered, probably not a massive hit, but that's a really cool card. I like that. And then we are going to our rookies. Tyrese Halliburton rookie. We'll take that. And who do we have here? Bogdanovich on the international ticket. All right, so not a bad fat pack. I definitely think the fat pack uh, beat out the blaster, to be honest. I like the hits from the fat pack better. So 2021 fat pack, keeping us happy and finishing things off strong. So far, we got some good hits out of it. This is going to be our second video for the week for the breaks. We're going to dig into that grading coming up here shortly, and we'll have some more breaks coming up soon. Do have some WWE blasters coming up. But thank you for tuning in, everybody. That is a rip and review. No bulls, all pulls. This is Shane Opax. Have a good evening. Oh, <laughs>